The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Los Angeles, California, weighing in at 219 pounds, John Morrison. Look at how conceited this competitor is. I am glad that there are mute buttons on social media for people like this. Oh my gosh, jealous much, Corey? Also, have some guts and unfollow if they bother you so much. The competition level has never been higher, but this guy's ready to prove he can hang. The WWE Universe just exploded! And his opponent, from Forest Lake, Minnesota, weighing in at 200 pounds, Crimson! Yeah, there's a superstar who truly believes that the entire WWE Universe revolves around them. It's gotta be this talent right here. I absolutely cannot believe what a superiority complex this superstar has. It takes a lot more competitors than this one to make WWE go around. Yeah, but it only takes one superstar to be the center of a universe, Saxton. And you're looking at him right now. He says it's all about dominance tonight and plans on showing why everyone backstage should be scared. You're looking at a well-traveled superstar who has seen a lot in the ring. With experience comes confidence. There's nothing you can throw at this competitor that could phase him in the slightest. He'll be looking to utilize. Take down. Looking for the cross face. Gets cinched in. This could be over. And you imagine what it would do to him. Looking to free the arm and does just that. Close line. Hoisted up. Inverted face lock. Applied. Inverted layout. DDT. That was impressive. Bullseye with the drop kick. Nice deep arm drag. And this has got to be it. Still only got one. These one counts are going to get harder and harder to kick out of. Roundhouse kick on the mark. Look at this. Northern light suplex. And he only stays down for a one count. It's hard to believe, but it looks like he still has some gas left in the tank. Well executed suplex. Great reversal. Oh yeah. my God, what an. Take down. Look at the cross face. It's cinched in. This could be over. After everything these two men have been through, it will it. They're going to free the arm and does just that. Oh, nice deep arm drag. He's lost some of his win now. Yes, he didn't come here to watch him boast and taunt. Placed into the corner. Oh, God. Oh, hanging off for dear life. Oh! Oh, uh, what a counter. Brought down with a roundhouse. Across the top rope. Just a debilitating neck breaker. Sidekick finds the mark. Oh my gosh, what impact. Oh, check that out. Oh, and a course through neck breaker. Here's his window. Will he Makes take advantage? What a kick out at 
two. You gotta be kidding me. Surviving that maneuver is absolutely amazing. The next big move might end this. The question is, who has the stamina left? And there's the cover. Kick out just before two. Wow, I thought this was over. Oh, torturous knee. And he wants nothing to do with any of that. Gets inside the ring. Just carrying the opposition anywhere they want. Snake eyes. Carefully placed stomp to the arm. And a steam. Oh, a knee right to the face. Oh, man. Vicious right forearm. Caught an elbow to the gut for that effort. Boom! Thanks for coming. The superstar building incredible momentum. Oh, I mean, this is... I don't know how the superstar is doing it. Down and out moments ago. Back in it now. Ridiculous standing shooting star. Into the corner he goes. A perfectly placed... Going high risk. Split left! Can it be capitalized on? Looking for the victory! Two! Oh, and he just kicked out. Man, oh man, what resilience. He's got to be running on instinct alone. Listen, that should have ended things. And look at his face. At this point, you have to believe he's losing some faith in himself. Oh, you got to be kidding me. Plucked out of the air. Have you ever seen such disdain from this superstar? Take down. Look at the cross face. It's cinched in. This could be over. Right, this one's over. Tap out coming. We're going to free the arm and does just that. Boot to the stomach gives them separation. Neck breaker, seemingly out of nowhere. Here we go again. Omega driver. That hit the spot. He's finished. Cover! And that will end it. Here is your winner, Crimson. And this victory is one for the record books. Putting your body on the line like that is a huge risk. This match could have gone very differently. But in the end, Corey, they are the ones celebrating. Anxiously waiting for his opponent in this match. Here he is, and here we go! So much bad blood between these two. They didn't want to wait, and neither do we. Let him go! They can't wait to get things started! No use wasting any more time. These two have reached a boiling point. After a shotgun attack during the entrances, this match has found its way inside the ring at last. Now we can really get things started. But should we really be going through with this match after what happened before the bell? Well, if you want to go stand in the way of these superstars, go for it. From where I'm sitting, it doesn't look like there's any stopping them. Oh, wicked kick to the lower back. Drops the hammer right on the lower back. Big clothesline. Tossed into the corner. Wicked clothesline. Looking to apply an agonizing armbar stretch. Just stretching out the arm. You have to protect your shoulders from hits like that. You don't want to compromise your ability to throw a punch or lock in a hole. Carefully placed stomp to the arm. 
Drops the hammer. The cover. Stops the ref count before two. Loose cover leads to a strong kick out. Taking aim on the arm. Up high. Cross body from the top. And the fight has been taken to Hurricane. Good luck stopping Shawn Michaels at this rate. It's hard to pick just one thing that has made Shawn Michaels so successful over the years. That's just it, Cole. HBK is one of the most well-rounded superstars the WWE Universe has ever seen. He possesses exceptional speed, strength, athleticism, and charisma. He uses all of that and more in each and every match, and that's what makes him the showstopper. I risk the elbow drop. Cover! Two! And this one is over. Here is your winner, the Heartbreak Kid, Shawn Michaels! They had a plan and it worked to perfection. Yeah, their opponent was just unable to overcome the damage caused by that earlier attack. What a tough loss. After a loss like this, under these circumstances, I have to think it brews more bad blood here. Yeah, the word revenge comes to mind, but all that will have to wait for another day. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Minneapolis, Minnesota, weighing in at 286 pounds, Brock. The WWE Universe delivering quite a reaction, perhaps the most highly anticipated match of the night. Doesn't matter where or when he's competing, this guy just wants to fight, and he's about to get one. And his opponent, from Davenport, Iowa, weighing in at 217 pounds, the WWE United States Champion, Seth. And guys, this looks to be a match with major implications here in WWE. Could change the entire landscape here.
The champ planning to show his dominance in this division with an emphatic win tonight. And while this is a non-title matchup, let's not ignore that the champion has quite the chip on their shoulder coming into this. Yeah, they'll be able to walk out of this one with their title regardless. But you know they'd rather get the win and prove they really are the top dog in this division. You're right, Corey. They're definitely not going to want... Send him over the top rope! And there's going to be more, Michael. There's going to be more! This is in the wheelhouse! Oh! Suicide dive! That was coming in hot at breakneck speed. Going fast and living dangerously. Headlock applied, tossed their opponent. And gets tossed back into the mat. Makes him pay with a counter. He got whipped into that corner. Knees to the gut repeatedly. Release German! This is it! Three, no! Obviously still has some fight left. Watch this display of power. It is sit out power bomb. Thunderous impact. Taking it outside the ring now. Getting tossed. He's absorbed some damage already. This will win the match. Ah, oh, the bear hug. And a way to get out of it is being on display right here. Returning to the ring now. Oh, you can tell he's feeling it now. This fight is pumping him up. He's going for it all. From the top. Through the air. And connect. It doesn't matter if you're on the outside of the ring. There is no place safe when you face such a risk taker. Slim blade! Two. Got it cinched Three. in. This could be uh -oh. it. Oh, my God. A small package driver. Three. Hoist it up. Oh. Gut buster. Kick to the gut. Cranked around into a neck breaker. He's taking some good hits. Here we go. Okay, he's re-entering the ring. Tempted fate and paid dearly for it. That haphazard approach definitely proved costly. He's getting a huge... Perfect time to attack when his guard is down. Oh, uh, look out. Oh, the high risk doesn't pay off. A completely ill-advised decision. Likely going to pay for it in the rest of this match. Ah, uh, Fisherman suplex. Big forearm. Setting up for something here. Oh, driven face first into the apron. Knee to the face. There it is. Boom. Nice. Is it enough? The cover. Kicks out. Almost inhuman at this point. Eyes on the target. Elevated knee drop. He's positioning himself. Uh oh. Batten down the hatches. Opportunity is his for the taking. Can you imagine how much escaping that pin must have cost him? I can. These are the moments where you really find out how tough you are. When I mean, your opponent can hang after all that, you're wondering if earning a win might just be impossible. Oh, what a German suplex. Oof. 
knee driven right through the face and again. Still not and done. again. Yikes. Saving us from having to sit through that. Able to reverse. The body is starting to fail at this point. He needs to get himself some room to regroup fast. Up and... Oh, knee right to the spine. Ooh. Oh, my gosh. You can see as he rises how vulnerable of a position he's in. We're about to see... better myself. Try and end it. And he's still in the game. Are we sure that wasn't three? Uh, just about as close as you can get. And there needs to be a refocus now. That was the moment that could have ended things. A moment that's being replayed in their heads right now. And he's able to reverse. Well executed takedown. And it's reverse pain for that mistake. We gonna see here. The wheels uh -oh. are turning. Here we go. All the uh -oh. way. Uh -oh. Suicide dive. Just exhibiting their fearlessness. Exhibiting guts and accuracy as well. Oh, what are they gonna do here? Elevated knee drop connects. Look at him totally vibing with the WWE Universe right now. Enough already. And he tosses him back in now. And up the turnbuckles we go. Look at the height. Frog splash. And that will leave him with a cause for concern. We're getting into desperation mode for him. I understand the sentiment but now is not the time to bask in disbelief. Ooh. Stationary position. Uh-oh. Shifts it back onto him. Knee right to the gut. Punch lands. Go for the arm bar and a... Oh. Suplex and not done yet. Another German. A trio of. Here's a cover. Could be it. And the ref stops the count. The Kimura. Oh, the Kimura. Kimura lock applied. Good luck getting out of this. I guess that's one way to do it. Wait a minute, setting in. Devastating submission coming. The heel hooks in. This will tear your knee apart. I'm not quite sure if this man shouldn't tap out. This is about Fighting out of it. Successfully does. Couple effective shots. Turning the tables there. Quick exchange of counters there. He's trying again. Oh, stop! Big opportunity for him now. Cover! What? Only two? I don't know how he just kicked out, and I'll tell you what, I don't really think he knows either. Though you gotta believe he'll be looking for the kill shot one more time. No, no, no! Barrel roll, Tope! That is reckless abandon being shown. And paying off as well. Listen to this place. It's unreal. The decibel level in here right now is breaking glass. These fans are on fire. Stops the kick. Seeing an answer for every move attempted. 
Look at this. Snap suplex. Hope you boys put your running shoes on. It might be time to clear out. Oh, countering with a chop block will halter any attack. Heading back to the ring. Oh, right to the spine with the knee. That was vicious. Oh, vicious body shot. F5! Thunderous! But can they turn that into a win? And the victory! Here is your winner, Brock. He really wanted this one bad. Yeah, what a major win for him here. This was a grueling match both physically and mentally, but to the victor goes the spoils. Here comes the big dog! The following is a submission match. Making his way to the ring from Pensacola, Florida, weighing in at 265 pounds, Roman Reigns. You know, Corey, really the bridge between two generations in this match. And Roman Reigns anxious to claim his rightful place at the top of the WWE food chain but he can't do that without knocking off the top dog, John Cena. You know, when you go throughout WWE history, you think of the different eras and Hulk Hogan followed up by Stone Cold and The Rock. And then, of course, John Cena. Is this generation, this era, going to be defined by this man, Roman Reigns? Well, John Cena has gone as far as to lay down that challenge to the big dog. One of the most dominating superstars of recent era. You can go ahead and say it, Cole, of all time. Here comes the doctor of thugonomics. And his opponent from West Newberry, Massachusetts. Weighing in at 248 pounds, John Cena! I can't wait for Cena to come out here and spit some of that hot fire. I like the attitude of John Cena. Reminds me of when I used to freestyle. Where, in Burke? Burke VA, baby. Stepping up to the tribal chief and the entire bloodline. 
I hope this guy brought a lunch because it's going to be a long, long night. When I competed in a submission match, I made sure I did my homework before the match even began. What kind of homework are you talking about? I made a list of every single nick and cut and injury that my opponent ever suffered in their career. Then, when I was in the ring, I made sure to exploit every single one of them. Uh, that seems a little underhanded, Corey. Well, what you call underhanded, I call incredibly intelligent. Exploiting weaknesses is what submission matches are all about. Look at this raw power. Sit out, power bomb. Takes their breath out. Effective counter. The tribal chief has it cinched in. There's a cravat. Sleeper hold submission. And it's and breaks the hole, but damage has been done. He reverses it. Just like that, Roman gets stopped. Close line. What now? Inverted vertical suplex. Gouging at the face. This is gnarly. Come on, enough. That's not right. Uh-oh. Elbow drop. Oh, what are they going to do? Oh, look at this. Look at this power. No way. He's getting a little batter now. There are some superstars that seem to thrive in a submission match environment. What do you think sets those superstars apart from their peers, Corey? Innovation and opportunity, Cole. You have to be able to slap a submission on from any angle, in any position, at any time. It's that ability that will set you apart in a match like this. Oh, caught by the back elbow. Oh, this is just too far. Get some control in there. Oh, look at this aggression, just oh. pure brutality. Come on, easy. Boom! That's mounted with punches and not and a Oof. stop to the gut, too. Oh my goodness, dribbling the opponent's head like a basketball. Punched him right in the mouth. Relentless. Oh, enough already. Ooh, what a nasty kick. Just disrespectful. And now I see some blood on the face of Cena. Boom, right in the button. That hit connects from Roman Reigns. Oh, that is going to leave a mark. He's looking a little weary now. Roman turning up the pressure and the heat there. Superman punch by the Tribal Chief. No coming back from Reigns after that. Oh, and soon we could be seeing a submission here. Cena with nowhere to go. Is Cena going to tap out? And he very quickly counters. Up and with a protoplex. Oh, watch out. Cena's got him up. May have just vanquished Reigns. And now he's looking to lock in this submission. Hands locked under the chin, and this camel clutch is fully locked in. Tap out. A single leg camel clutch oh, and a great no. counter. Whatever's playing here can't be good. Oh my God, superhuman power. John Cena is in a bad way, guys. The head of the table cinches it in. Guillotine applied. Cena, Cena's in trouble. Is Cena gonna submit? How much can Cena withstand? How much pain can Cena take?
He is desperately trying to maneuver out of this and successfully does. Arms trap. Oh, just endless knee strikes. Reigns heads up. This is going to be good. He skirts away, living to fight another day. Look out! Good Lord! Taking flight! And that was a collision you don't want to be on the receiving end of. Came down like a wrecking ball on a cinder block. Goodness gracious. Oh my goodness. Ah, what a smash! That is just insulting. Ah, the power of Roman Reigns! And now thrown back into the ring. Here's the pump handle. Suplex! Launched. How's that for a counter? Big counter from Reigns. Reigns, guillotine applied. I have no idea how he hasn't tapped out yet. All the heart, all his desire being put to the test. The guillotine locked in. This is all. No, it was an incredible counter. He went right into that turnbuckle. Devastating elbow. Really just laying it in. Gonna be agonizing for the arm. Off the turnbuckles. What's he gonna do? Watch out. Elbow drop. Piercing. Look at this. Snap suplex. What now? Goodness. Inverted suplex. Oh, man. Scouted it and fired back with a punch straight to the face. Tagged with a punch. Ah, oh, jeez. Oh, Roman Reigns locked and loaded, measuring his opponent. Here we go. There! Reigns got all of it. Oh, look at the start of this. Could be going into the playbook for submission. Hey, win tonight! May I tap out? He taps, and this submission match is over. Here is your winner, Roman Reigns. And that is the head of the table standing tall against Big Match John. Reigns can add yet another name to his path of destruction. Cena put up quite the fight, but in the end, it just wasn't enough to overcome Reigns. It was quite the battle, though. Kevin Owens is always ready for a fight. The following is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Marieville, Quebec, Canada. Weighing in at 266 pounds, Kevin Owens. Well, he calls himself the prize fighter, and he's earned that moniker as of late. You're absolutely right, Saxon. You have to remember main event battles with Stone Cold Steve Austin and Roman Reigns. A look of pure focus on the face of the prize fighter. Because KO always has his eyes on the prize.
one of the biggest names in WWE, the Viper. And his opponent from St. Louis, Missouri, weighing in at 245 pounds, Randy Orton. The Viper won his first WWE Championship at the age of 24, the youngest world champion in history. Such an accomplished career for this young man. But gentlemen, we know that the Viper is at his best when he hunts alone. Methodical, dangerous, Randy Orton has earned his spot at the top of WWE. He has beaten nearly every big name, slain nearly every legend. You gotta wonder, what's next for the Viper? Championship, Saxton, and plenty of them. Over the course of his career, Kevin Owens has shown us that he's not the kind of guy who backs down from a fight. If anything, I'd say the more the odds get stacked against Kevin Owens, the more dead set he is on going through with the match. We'll see if that bullish approach helps drive him there. And across the way is the apex predator, Randy Orton, a man whose cunning tactics and deadly... No way! Slingshot senton! That is tossing your own body around without a care. Taking no account for their own well-being. Ooh, DDT. Corey, we've talked before about how Kevin Owens can get frustrated when things don't go. Oh, what's coming here? Submission move being applied. This won't win the match, but it's one way to inflict a great... And he very quickly counters. And now gets tossed into the ring. This could be big, going up high. Soaring. Oh, God, that, that, that's a bad landing. Taken to the air and completely wiping out. What a shot. Delivered into the barricade. Oh, and he slammed his face right into the barricade. Belly to belly. Short arm clothesline. Just punched him right in the mouth. Relentless. Oh, enough already. What a punch. Action needs to return to the ring and fast. Ball away, slam. And count outs are legal, so hopefully this will be a short trip outside. Seven, nine. Taking the fight near our announce table. I really hope we get these desks at a discount. This is just vicious. No, oh, no, 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 that'll break his arm. Vicious. Counters that. Solid contact from the Viper. Oh, man, right to the arm. Viper extends your elbow. He's absorbing some tough hits now. That is the sort of bloodthirsty offense that Randy Orton does so well. Belly to belly. Oh, man, they do not care who or what they destroy. Yeah, Byron, you are dangerously close to being collateral damage in this one. From the top. Diving elbow driver. You get the cover for the win. Got him now and a kick what? out by KO. He just 
kicked out by a fraction of a second. That's it. I think KO might be out. Two. No, he beats the count. Owen's showing that he didn't come here to be beat. He's here for a fight. But now this is when Randy Orton is at his most dangerous, a viper who's had a taste and knows what it takes to win. Vintage Orton! Orton's not going to do this. Orton's not going to do this. Oh, and that buys... about to sew this up. There's two! That was amazing! Orton is still in this! The Viper still has a lot of fight left in him. And KO is pissed off. That kick out just lit an even bigger fire under Owens. Can there be frustration mounting in these competitors knowing it's going to take more to win this one? You can't let those feelings seep into your psyche. You have to keep your focus. Jarring back elbow. What a punch! I don't like the look in his eye here, folks. Probably not going to win for a couple hundred years, Byron. You know why? Because the Billy Goat's curse is in effect. I can't stand this move. Hi, Colt. Oh, just tap out. Just tap out and end this thing. Losing this match would absolutely destroy it. Agonizing hole. Got to find a way out, and they do. Big back body draw. Oh, you see the height on that? Stunner. Owens hits the stunner. That just put down the Viper. Near fall. Orton escaping by the skin of his teeth with that one. He has to think that was too close for comfort. A limit, Owens, realizing he's going to have to do even more to finish this. And knowing the lengths he will go to win, that could mean something very dangerous. Big oh. impact. This arena has come unglued. You can feel the foundation shifting with every turn in the match. Into the barricade. Well placed, kick to the gut. Another damaging Bang. kick. Oh, and a close line to follow. And he gets set back into the ring. Morton going to that place could be academic from here. Devastating attack from the Viper. For the win! There's two! What a decisive victory for Randy Orton. Incredible. Here is your winner, Randy Orton. Ended this match with a big win under his belt. Randy Orton's legend continues with a big win here tonight. Things are about to get good. The following is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from New York. Weighing in at 275 pounds, the Assassin.
You are looking at some highly motivated competitors in this match, looking to steal the show and capture the attention of the entire WWE Universe. He is in perhaps the best shape of his career, and he will need that with the competition level this high. The animal has been unleashed. And his opponent from Washington, D.C., weighing in at 290 pounds, the animal Batista. Oh, the animal will punish with no remorse and no mercy. Batista's story is that of indescribable rage. He has this insatiable desire to inflict pain on his prey. Yeah, it is really frightening when you think about what Batista is truly capable of. He won the Royal Rumble in two different decades. He's a decorated champion, a Hollywood action movie star. And Batista doesn't care what anyone thinks. He's obsessed with what he wants, and what Batista wants is domination. Time to unleash the rage. And with the bell, Batista is ready for action here. And Batista looks as imposing as ever. An absolute physical specimen. His predatory animal instinct only amplifies the fear that his opponent must be feeling right now. And we all know that Batista loves the thrill of the hunt. Across the way is a man who's rededicated his focus. Someone who's been spending extra time training and scouting for his competition. Sends him into the corner. Lands the elbow. Now trampling the opposition. A second one. He avoids the damage. Start counting, Saxton. One, two. Three, we could one, be here four. all day. Power. I think you're right. Rotating vertical suplex. Nicely done. Stiff kick. Showing him what a real alpha male looks like. Close line. He's feeling the effects of that last hit. Compromised position here. Oh, right to the throat. Ooh. Oh my goodness, dribbling the opponent's head like a basketball. Right to the face. My God. Oh, he's got him here, he's got him up. And oh! Batista has always relied on his tremendous strength. Corey, will that be enough to get the job done tonight? Well, many say that's why Batista dominated WWE, but he's developed new tools to supplement that strength. Tonight, he should mix his power with his MMA background, which will add even more devastation to his joint and limb manipulation. Watch that! Gosh, landing face first. Superhuman! 
He could pin his opponent right here. It's over. Almost ended it there. That is just pure instinct at this point. DDT. Batista is out of his cage. This is exactly what I was talking about. That's Batista being a ferocious animal and a methodical mixed martial artist. Well scattered reversal there. Yeah, he's able to stop the bleeding, but will he also gain command? Cover here! No, he gets the shoulder up. Somehow, some way, he is still in this. Incoming! Whoa! What a landing! And after that, you know things have just kicked up a notch. Pedal to the metal right now. Uh-oh. He's got the answer for that one. Whip back into the ring. And Batista get Break to the uh-oh. Batista turns it around. Let him set up. This could be it, Corey. Batista bomb. Match ending power. Two count. Oh, he was almost finished. He is just barely still in the fight. I don't know how many more times he's going to be able to kick out after that. That was too close for comfort. And Batista visibly frustrated now as he's not being given what he wants. The animal just might be unleashed as a result of the aggravation. So confident is Batista. He thinks he's got this one all sewed up. He's heading to the floor, but he can't take his time. He climbs into the ring. Big boot! He may get the three count right here! This is it. Kick it out before the count. This is where great cardio makes all the difference, helping you stay alive deep into the match. And the knee. And just check out the face of Batista. Uh-oh! Dark matter! Batista looks knocked out. Was an unbelievable kick out from Batista. I've lost count of how many times this match should have ended by now. We knew we were in for something. From the top. Elbow drop. Good Lord. Really seems like Batista is in a world of hurt. No question about it. Yeah, this match has not been kind to him. Batista needs to fight. Straight to the gut. Double under. Oh, future shock. Now's the time to capitalize. Makes the cover. An exhausting match, but a victory he'll savor forever. Here is your winner, The Assassin. And that's a textbook win. A lot to be proud of there. Tonight, calling Batista the animal only makes sense if you're referring to a gerbil. Don't tell him I said that. And here comes one of our favorites. The following is a tornado tag handicap match.
making his way to the ring from Death Valley, weighing in at 309 pounds, the Superstar. We're looking at some of the most intense competitors in all of WWE, about to take part in one of the most anticipated matches ever. He calls himself the standard bearer of this division and plans on proving it in a matter of moments. opponents first from Greenwich Connecticut weighing in at 248 pounds Mr. McMahon you know Corey when sometimes we show up at hotels in different towns at three or four o'clock in the morning Mr. McMahon's there with his trainer heading to the gym the physical embodiment of success the man's got grapefruits the size of small planets and has to feel like a billion dollars stepping into the ring amidst his own creation. Well, I know he considers himself the best in the world, Shane O'Mac. And from New York City, weighing in at 235 pounds, Shane McMahon! You are looking at a man who will not back down no matter what the odds. Yeah, one of the biggest risk takers in WWE history. I think Shane's already scouting something he can leap from in this match. A two-on-one handicap match is underway. No rest for the superstar facing off against the numbers game. If I had a million dollars and could make any kind of match, it would be this. Two opponents. And what he's looking for here looks like a potential submission maneuver coming. It's cinched in. I think we're just moments away from seeing a tap out. We're hearing a snap. Punch right to the face. Bam! Down he goes. Bad predicament right here. Scoop slam sets things up. Countered it just in time. Shane McMahon finds his target with that one. Just disrespectful. Elbow drop. Piercing. Oh, 
Look at this. Oh, from the rope. He's going for the pin. This could be it. Into the pay window. Kicks out. He still has life. Getting that shoulder up now is huge. Oof. Point of the elbow counters that. What a boot. Not the position you want to be in right now. Nice scoop slam. Oh, that was just malicious. How are they going to hear after this match? Shot after shot. Oh, ruthless striking. Boom, what a punch. He had it scouted. Shane just trying to get under the skin of his opponent. Headlock. Oh, and cheap shot right above the eye. And just like that, he sent crashing to the floor. Shane McMahon up top. From the top. What? You want to talk about putting it all on the line. Always an extra risk when you dive ringside. And he throws the opposition back into the ring. Close line. What impact. Vicious right forearm. Stopped them in their tracks with a kick to the gut. Short punch. Sleeper hold cinched in deep. Fading, fading. Oh no, this is not where he wants to be. Yeah, and but can he roll on his body? Can he roll? And breaks out of the sleeper. He's channeling the crowd's energy. Ooh, pinpoint. This could be the beginning of the end. Uh-oh. Sharp shooter! It's not embarrassing to tap out. He'll save your career. But his will to win is simply... Got to find a way out of the sharpshooter. And does just that. Oh, what a four. No telling what's underneath the ring tonight. The steel chair. Never as innocent as it looks. And he makes the save for his team. Just like Mr. McMahon. Absolutely no class. Absolutely brilliant. Oh, side headlock applied. Oh, what a good Punch. measure. This is what you call high risk, high reward. The sound of this crowd is deafening, and he's at... From way up. Whoa, look out. Taken out from high above. You gotta be some special kind of crazy to do that. Shane just trying to get under the skin of his opponent. Close line. Oh, that'll leave a mark. Taking this to the floor. position to be in right now. Oh my goodness. He heads outside. Count out's legal in this match. Sent straight into the barricade. Wrist lock applied. Oh man, look at this power. Just one step ahead. Goes under the ropes to get back inside. corner. Ooh. Just like Mr. McMahon. Absolutely no class. Absolutely brilliant. Taking out the arm. Great strategy. Military press. Ooh. The jaw. Oh, what a shot. Scoop slam. Leg drop across the throat. Caught 
with a neck breaker. He's looking a little off balance. Ooh, sidewalk slam. Mr. McMahon is really being knocked around here. Every form of offense Mr. McMahon attempts has been halted. <laughs> what power! Is that what it takes to beat Mr. McMahon? Ooh, gut punch. Nasty. The finishing touches could be coming Shane's way here. Shane O'Mac wards that off. Shane managing to find some of that needed breathing room. Brief sign of adrenaline there for him. At this juncture, you have to wonder if these superstars can keep up this pace. They're certainly being taken into the deep waters now. Oh, what a boot. Heads outside, but this one has to end in the ring. Shane just trying to get under the skin of his opponent. Gentlemen, in the interest of self-preservation, I may have to excuse myself. Saxton, you hang tight. Let this play out. Able to get the advantage here. Sidewalk slam! Almost drove him through the ring. Just like Mr. McMahon, absolutely no class. Absolutely brilliant. Put into the corner now. Ooh! A right, a couple of knees, and some trash talking as well. Oh. Into the cover! Oh. No! Kick out of two! I am in shock. What's it gonna take to keep this guy down? Ooh, ruthless striking. He has a task at hand, but prefers to be showboating right now. Oh. Out of the ring. What's his plan here? Shane just trying to get under the skin of his opponent. And he goes into the ring. Spiked. This one is headed outside, guys. The WWE Universe. Uh-oh. Stunner from Mr. McMahon. Mr. McMahon with a game ender. So goes down. Oh, finally monumental victory. Here are your winners. Mr. McMahon and Shane. This is a big win for them here and a must-win match. That's what happens when you put in the preparation and the training. The leader of the Attitude Era, the Rattlesnake. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Victoria, Texas, weighing in at 252 pounds, one half of the World Tag Team Champions, Stone Cold Steve Austin. Watch your five hole, Saxton. Anybody see my ice pack? Austin, trademark scowl on his face. The biggest anti-hero in WWE history. Stone Cold Steve Austin says what he wants, does what he wants, and he's not afraid of the repercussions. but I got goosebumps. The people's champion is here. 
Listen to these people. They're going nuts. Team Bring It is in the building. Saxton, you couldn't warm the bench for Team Bring It. And his opponent from Miami, Florida, weighing in at 265 pounds, The Rock. Well, here's a man who's captured the imagination of the entire sports entertainment industry, the Brahma Bull, one of the very best of all time. Without question, The Rock has been a champion at every level. Hey, Saxton, your role, know it. Your mouth, shut it. That wasn't very nice. One thing you can't do, guys, is brawl with the Texas Rattlesnake. No, you're absolutely right about that, Cole. This superstar needs to rely on his technical ability and expertise because you don't want to throw hands with the Rattlesnake. This match is nothing but personal for these two legends. The Rock and Stone Cold, two men who seem to be on a permanent collision course with each other. From all-time great WrestleMania matches to championship altercations, it's true, they just can't get away from one another. But it's always exciting to see two guys with so much history go at it in the ring. This is going to be one hard-fought, hellacious battle that'll either end with a beer bath or a residency at the SmackDown Hotel. And he's a step ahead of Austin. First a knife edge chop and now continuing the attack on the knee. Straight to the knee. Set him up. Russian leg sweep. Oh, he retaliates. Stone Cold's really got to stay focused here. He's got to keep his temper in check and not let himself get lured into a vulnerable position. But you have to admit, that's tricky, Corey. Austin's temper is often what drives him over the finish line. Headlock. Oh, and cheap shot right above the eye. Now he's been put on the defensive. Almost drove him through the ring. Heads out of the ring. What's next? Set him up. Russian leg sweep. Oklahoma slam. Basement drop kick. Sleeper hold cinched in deep. Fading, fade, and breaks out of the sleeper. Great counter. Sidewalk slam. Targeting a body part, working the arm. Just rake in the face. This is outright disrespectful. Here he goes for the win. And he kicks out of the pen and won. We are this far into the match. Where is this energy? Stone Cold Stunner. The Rock just got checked in. He kicked out of two. What? Guys, I really thought The Rock was about to be beat. Anger is starting to show in the face of Austin. I think the Rattlesnake will do anything to close this out. There's press and unleash it for the win. Absolute power. As close to three as you could possibly get without the bell ringing. Quick thinking by The Rock. 
dodges out of the way. We've seen Rock and Austin take each other to the limits. Tonight is proving no different. I've got chills. I never thought we'd see this again. He's taking this to the floor now. Getting carried around. Bad spot to be in. Oh, my goodness. Short clothesline hits its mark. On a step ahead of the rock. Reciprocating the initial reversal. Stone Cold Steve Austin has him where he wants him. Pile driver. Tossed back into the ring. He's not going to let up either. He came here to have a fight and put boots to asses. He's going for the pin. This could be it. Oh. And a kick out at two. This is going to come down to who wants it more. Oh, a wicked kick to the lower back. The Rock telling his opponent to get their candy, you know what, over here. Line. Uh oh. Great wherewithal on the counter. Stop cold! Stop cold! Stop cold! Stutter! Austin's got it! Austin's got it! Steve Austin picks up a strong victory. Here is your winner. Stone Cold Steve Austin! Stone Cold Steve Austin overcame the odds to defeat the Great One in a big match. The Brahma Bull could not keep the Rattlesnake down, and it cost The Rock the match.